Yeah, man. No, just uh, getting ready to do another shoot. Yeah, I'm gonna get started here for. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What what happened with that? Well, I put my props on backwards. You know what I mean? And I was like, I can't. I can't believe it did that. So I was like, ah, whatever. <laughs> My name is Tommy, this is First Look, but it's not like the first look that you're used to. Y'all said, I like being in the know, but I need like just a little more information. And so that's what we're gonna do. Moving forward, First Look is gonna be focused on one product. And today we're gonna talk about an antenna. And it's called the Micro Axi Antenna. Now, first of all, let me just let me just back up here for a second. The OG, the original Axie antenna, that was like the go-to antenna. Why? Because it had all the same performance as some of the other circular polarized antennas out there, but it was the smallest and it was the lightest. And if you're into FPV, that's what you're after. And so when Lumineer hit me up and said, hey, Tommy, we're gonna send you this new antenna that we got and it's actually smaller, I was like, what? what? And here it is, here's the box. Now, first of all, and the first thing that comes to my mind is, there's nothing in here, man. And, uh, well, th then you're, you're, <laughs> you're still like, uh, there's, there's like nothing in there. Can you see that? Do you even see an antenna in there? There's no antenna. But then you open it up a little bit and you're like, oh, oh, -hoo. wow. That's actually a lot smaller than I was anticipating. Uh, okay. Now they say this is the same performance as the OG axi antenna so there's really no reason to go anywhere else guys this is it this is the antenna that you want to use because if it does the same as far as performance goes why go with something bigger if you've got a build you've got the antenna on there already just keep it i get it but you're probably gonna crash and if it's a big old hunking antenna it's probably gonna break and when that day comes look at that i'm 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 actually, I'm actually surprised. <laughs> I really thought maybe, you know, I'm a strong dude, you know what I'm saying? Maybe if I smack that table hard enough, but folks, you're seeing it right here. So there's no other reason why to go with anything else, fellas. If this is the same performance, but it's lighter and it's smaller, you're gonna break your quad. It's time to buy a new antenna. This is the one to get. Does it get shorter? Yes, it does. The guys at Lumineer was like, I'm gonna make this in all kinds of flavors. I'm gonna make that in a right hand MMCX, right? Standard size, standard size, 70 millimeters. You've got the shorty, 30 millimeters, cable length. Still has that UFL connection. Maybe you're not a UFL kind of guy. Maybe you want to go with the standard SMA. All I'm trying to say is Lumineer, they got all the flavors. Maybe you're just one of those leftist guys. Maybe you just want to be the opposite, right? Got one for you. Check that out. That white cap is what signifies that left hand circular polarized antenna now it can get a little bit better because i don't know about you but one of my favorite antennas was the og axi stubby now the stubby is the one that it has no cable at all it, it's just goes straight to an sma and you, you screw it on i wish i had one that i could show you guys but it is by far my favorite antenna for my basher builds because on the basher builds you just don't want anything sticking out you just want everything as tight and compact as it could possibly be and they're gonna come out with that they're also gonna come out with this pre-tinned version which is really just kind of this with that with no connector so for like the ultimate in like weight savings you can actually just solder on directly your antenna i'm into micro quads and i know that when you build these small 1.9 two inch quads every gram counts so you got to build it with the smallest and the lightest components and up until this came out that was the small linear dipole antenna and the problem with the linear dipole antenna is if you got more than one person in the air your video it, it it just starts to suck with this entering the micro game now you can get more than one person up in there at the same time and that is what the fun is all about is when you can get all your friends flying and y'all having a good time y'all have good video if you got a good video you're having a good day if you're having a good day you're having a whole bunch of fun that's what it's all about let's find out how how much it weighs one 
one gram, maybe even a hair over one gram. So this thing is super light, guys. All right, if you guys don't believe me on the performance, check out my man Hugo. Link in the description. He checks out in depth the performance aspect. In that video, it really shows just how well this antenna is at rejecting opposing polarizing signals. Every single one of their antennas gets hand checked. That's right, QC checked before it leaves that factory. So you know, once it comes out of this box, this thing works. This thing is up to spec and that's where Lumineer is at. All right, here we go. We are almost at the end of this episode, but it ain't the end without a giveaway. Today is no different. If you guys want to win an antenna, and I know you do, go on Instagram. Use hashtag first look axi. That's first look AX. I, I post a picture of your damaged antenna or where this antenna should go on your quad and leave in the description, you know, do you need a standard 70 millimeters? Do you need the shorty, which is 30 millimeters? Maybe you want that stubby, the one that just screws on. And then let me know, is it a UFL? Is it MMCX? Are you a little bit more old school? Do you need that SMA? Put that down. And if we pick you guys as a winner, we'll go ahead and ship you out that antenna, that specific one that you guys want. All right, fellas, that is the end of today's episode of First Look. Drop it in the comments. Let me know what is the next thing that you guys want to check out here on First Look. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to buy this antenna. It is ready to go. I'll see y'all in the next one. You need a three syllable nickname Offstage camera that I can, you know what I'm saying? Camera guy, right? No, camera guy, right? That's too, that's way too. Right, right, the camera guy? No, no, that is just <laughs> way too corny AF. <laughs>